In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix ARC riders crashing error that is happening for many users right now whenever they're trying to play the game. They get an error which says unhandled exception error. Then how we can fix it? So the first and one is all about we need to verify the game file. So just go over here, right click and go to the properties. Now from here, click on installer file. Just click on verify integrity of game file. So this will take a little bit of time. So I'm going to skip this part, just click on this and it will cross check every single file of a game. And if any files are captured and if any files are missing, all these kind of issues will be fixed by this. So you have to check it and that is what we have to do as the first step. Next one is all about what you need to do. So you have to minimize everything, go over here, search for the settings and click on the settings. Now from here, what you need to do is just click on system and go to the power. And from here, what you need to do is just click on the power mode. And from here, you have to drop it down and setting to balance set. That is very important. So just change into the balance set one. Then you have to close it and you have to check. Next one is all about we have to go over here, search for device manager and you have to click on the device manager. Now from here, what you need to do is you have to expand this display adapters, right click on the graphics card. So if you have dual graphics card, then disable one of the one. Which means for me, I'm having the NVIDIA. This is my primary graphics card. So if you're having AMD, just right click on the AMD, go for disable it and only keep NVIDIA as your primary graphics card. Then you have to check. Make sure it's all about just go over here at the search, search for rent command and press enter. Now, now type percentage local app beta and just go for OK. Now from here, once you get into this, what you need to do is you have to navigate to a folder named Pioneer Game. So just keep scrolling down, you'll be able to find somewhere else here the pioneer game get it to this go to saver go to config windows client now from here you have to delete this after deleting this then what you need to do is you have to go over here in the game once again right click here and go to the properties set the value in the launch option to dx11 this is very important set the value to dx11 then you have to check with the game stay if you're having the trouble the only one solution is all about you can after doing these try just do a restart then you have to launch the game and most probably that's going to help you guys out. So these are the steps and I hope this kick it really self-free. That's it. Bye.